and welcome back to my channel. My name is Lauren Dawn. If you've never watched any of my videos, and if you have, welcome back. And I'm glad that you are able to watch this video. Um, okay, so today I am going to be talking a little bit about um, being kind of content where you are. Um, today at work we had what is called a Friendsgiving and we had basically a Thanksgiving. It was just work and friends. There was a time where we um, all got to go around and say what we were thankful for and um, I realized how thankful I am for God's faithfulness. Um, I am 23 years old. I graduated from high school when I was 17. It's not like I was ahead or anything. It's just my birthday is a lot later um, but I graduated um, high school when I was 17 and um, I had a multiple amount of jobs and I've talked about this before in the why I didn't go to college so I'm not gonna get too in-depth to it but basically um, I didn't know exactly wanted what I wanted to do I could see myself doing a lot of different things and that just kind of led to a bunch of different jobs um, I worked at a college I worked as a dance instructor um, I worked as a middle school math teacher I just had a bunch of different jobs and um, it was never I never really applied for one it was always by word of mouth um, and so I just went from one place to another and um, but in that whole time all of my friends were in college um, it came to a point where they were graduating from college and I sat and really still didn't know what I wanted to do um, and just decided that I was gonna sit back and got let God lead me where he wanted me to go even though I had no idea where that was I was a cheer coach and then last year I was actually a cheer coach and um, a lunch lady I worked in the lunchroom from the high school that I graduated from it was a very humbling experience I will tell you that um, but it was very difficult um, and I knew I didn't want to stay there but I was willing to um, but then what I want to come out and say is God is so faithful I love working with kids I love working with people I love helping people that's my passion I just didn't know what I wanted to do with that um, I also love videography graphic design um, any I've always loved that. Always, always, always have always loved videography and any kind of graphic design. I used to sit and play on PowerPoints um, just so that I could design stuff. So lame, but I enjoyed it. Um, so I um, realized like today while we were going around and I said what I was thankful for and I did say that God's faithfulness um, through my job I had no idea what I wanted to do I had I at times I would compare myself to what other my friends were doing um, or just people that I graduated from even if they weren't my friends I would get down on myself um, but it was a balance of being down on myself at times uh, but also having the faith in God to say look I don't know what I'm doing but I have faith that you do and um, so today I just realized that um, God has made this all to come come together I work at a foster care agency I don't think I've mentioned that before but I work at a foster care agency and I'm actually like the videographer and graphic design person for them uh, so I do a lot of their filming a lot of their um, like training stuff online um, I do other stuff but that's a, a lot what I do and just designing stuff and the fact that God has brought both worlds of working with kids helping people and being able to do graphic design I'm doing their YouTube for my job um, it just I'm coming on here to tell you that if you don't know what you want to do with your life if you feel discouraged if you're a senior in high school and you feel the pressure of going to college and you don't want to go to college um, I'm not giving you a list of this is how you succeed I'm giving you um, a blanket statement of God has a plan for you and your plan may not look for like everyone else's plan and that is completely okay it is we are not meant to be all the same we are not meant to um, all go in the same path and do the same thing um, if we were we'd get the same things accomplished and there's a ton of jobs um, to do and I don't mean like job jobs but just like things that need to be accomplished in this world that not everybody can do and I mean that seriously even if you've heard it before like I'm very serious about this like you are the only you and you have been given 
the only characteristics of you, which means that there are things in this world that you can only accomplish. I can't accomplish them because I'm not, um, I have not been given those characteristics or those gifts. Um, and so if you are feeling discouraged, I have a lot, like this is my, this is my thing. Like if you don't know what to do during certain things and you feel confused, I feel like the best thing to do is step back just step back from the situation and let God lead you to it. Um, I mentioned that like being single, like I just have kind of done that and I'm telling you that it works. Like, I mean, obviously I can't tell you that my Hallmark man has walked through the doors recently, but I'm having faith that he will and I will come on here when that happens and I will tell you about it. But I want to encourage you that your life is not going to look like everyone else's life. It may have similar characteristics. I'm not saying that. We do walk similar paths with similar people and things like that. But as a whole, if your life doesn't look like everyone else's, that is completely okay. And then on the flip side, if it does look like the majority, that's okay too. Like my sister is in college and she is going the route that a lot of people her age are going. Um, but I didn't and I wasn't supposed to, but she is and she is supposed to. So don't get caught up in the world and their ways. Like figure out what you are supposed to do. Figure out what God has made you to do. That doesn't always mean it's going to come easy. You might be put through the fire a little bit. You might be put through a lunchroom serving chicken fingers to everyone. Um, but there, I believe in um, God's faithfulness, and um, I did not know if I was going to be leaving that lunchroom. Um, I just went into it and, and hoped that God would lead me where I was supposed to go, and um, I am exactly, exactly where I it was supposed to be and I didn't even know what that was. I didn't even know what that looked like. I didn't know that you could have a graphic designer at a foster care agency working with kids and doing videography and graphic design. Um, so I hope that this encourages you. If you are having any kind of like struggles with your job or um, you just are like anxious and you don't feel like you're doing what you want to do, um, just know that sometimes we don't always get what we want in the time that we want it. Sometimes there needs to be a process. Sometimes things need to be worked out in the right way so that God can put the right things and the right people in your life to get you where you want to be. Um, and then also like a testing of your faith. Like, are you going to be faithful to him? Um, so... I hope that this encourages you. Um, I hope that you're having a great day. Um, don't um, leave this video unless you comment. Um, I mean, only if you want to. You don't have to. But um, if there's something that you may need prayer over, if you need um, some encouragement, if you want to leave me some encouragement, I just appreciate it all the way around. Like I feel like I give encouragement and then I feel like I get right it right back when people comment certain things to me and say, ooh, they're struggling with that too, or let me encourage you and let me tell you my story. And it, it, like it all, like I'm just, I am nothing special. Um, I just sit on a screen and I wanna talk to people and reach people that I, I'm not, I'm not capable to, I'm not able, capable, I'm not capable. I'm not able to reach if I was if I was just here, like not here, <laughs> if that makes any kind of sense. Um, so I hope that you like this video. Um, go ahead and subscribe. I've got something in, okay, this corner or this corner. I don't know. One of these corners. Um, if you like this video, uh, wait, no, subscribe, like this video if you liked it, and then give me a comment below. Um, I also have a few days left on my giveaway. It's closing on Friday if you want to enter that, and I hope that you have a wonderful day, and I will talk to you tomorrow in my next video.